Hey you guys, this is Darren with America Swimming Pool Company of Dallas. I just want to share a few tips with you on plastering a pool. We just got through using the SGM product scratch coat on this pool. We had to chip off all the old plaster. It had completely delaminated uh, from the gunite. So we took it all the way back down. And this is our bonding coat. This is our prep coat. This is what you want to see when you're replastering your pool. Make sure whoever you have doing your pool applies a coat similar to this. A lot of companies will mix up a plaster, dust, marble dust, put some glue with it and fling on, fling it with a brush. And it doesn't have any kind of grip, any, it's not coarse at all. It's just smooth and they call that a prepping. It's not a prepping and it won't take long at all for the plaster, the new plaster, to start delaminating from the old plaster. Don't get fooled with that. They'll give you a cheaper price in order to get the job, and they're prepping in a cheaper manner. We use a scratch coat made by SGM. It's a good product. I could rub my hand down like this and I'd come back with a bloody nub. That's how much it's gonna grip that new plaster. And make sure that they chip around all the, the return fittings so that when they apply the plaster, they can ply it up flush. That way you don't have that concave look. You, you wanna eliminate that and keep that flush right here. Let's take a look at some more of what's going on here. As you can see around the lights, again, you want them to chip it all the way around it. And then when you pour it up, the plaster, it'll be flush. We've done all the fittings on the tile. You want to saw cut and chip down to allow the new plaster to come up flush with that. So those are just some more tips from America's Swimming Pool Company of Dallas on plastering your pool. Thank you.